the caregiver, the yes. spouse, then has to uh, direct activities? Uh, uh, what happens if the patient is having word surge or they're finding themselves someplace where they didn't know? How do you protect that person? What does the caregiver do? I think every caregiver is a little different. Sometimes finding ways around it, a workaround is really important. Many times you'll see a spouse jump right in when there is a word finding problem rather than letting someone struggle. And sometimes I think that that is a better idea, particularly in a social setting where there's a lot of stress to answer something quickly. It's okay to jump in. You're not gonna make the word problem worse by answering for your spouse or your loved one. So the patient that knows they've got Alzheimer's and the caregiver knows they've got Alzheimer's know that sometimes word searching is a normal thing, but it's abnormal in their case. Are there key things that you can do? Should the caregiver interrupt and take over the conversation? How do you handle that? I think sometimes it's better to help out and sometimes not. Sometimes someone just needs a little more time to answer the question and it's a, it takes a good dose of patience. But at the same time, we have to remember that caregivers are feeling a sense of loss. There's tremendous feeling of loss, particularly with a life partner. If your spouse is, is now experiencing difficulties, you'll see a spouse that is taking over many other areas in household activities like the bill paying, maybe particularly wives that have never ever done this before are now having to assume this responsibility. It's a heavy burden. So we have to be pretty careful with caregivers and not give them too many tasks. 